Hello YouTube! Today I'm going to be showing you guys a uh, tutorial on how to install Dynap Live Map on your website. Now, all, websi all websites can be different uh, for what you have to do and everything. Now, first, is what you want to do. You want to go and install the plugin onto your Minecraft server and stop and restart your server. You'll get a folder that looks just like this and tons of stuff in here. Now, you don't have to worry about anything besides the configuration. Um, the only thing I ever touch is the is the definition template suffix. Now, that's what this is. It determines how exact your server is or like what your quality of your live map is. Um, it's, uh, it, it, show, it explains up to you up here um, for very low res, you can type uh, you can type V low res. Um, for just uh, no, just for low res, you type uh, low res, and then uh, high res, you just type high res. So it's pretty much self-explanatory. Um, I keep on high res, but it does take longer for you to do full render kind of does lag you up a little bit more, but I don't care. <laughs> well, to get started, you... First of all, you guys you have to port forward in, in this. You would port forward the 8123, if that's what port it's on. That's the default port. Um, after you port forward, you want to go to your website. Well, it, in the overall, it's going to be ending up looking like somewhat like this. Now, I haven't forwarded mine because I just got a new server. Um, you can do anything you want. Oh, it's kind of glitching out me. You can do anything you want, or like you can zoom in, type, chat. You can do the chat, search people. It's pretty useful. So what you want to do? You want to log on to your website and edit it. One second. All right. Alright, so once you guys get your server up, now like I said, all servers are going to be different. Uh, you want get to your, get to that tab, you want to put it on. And you want to insert it. I, when I first did it, I always got like this little blank screen, and I always got so frustrated, and it's because I didn't pull it forward, or you typed in something wrong. So what you want to do, it's an HTML, uh, you want, it's, it, you're entering an HTML. So, for those of you guys who know what you're doing, you probably will know, probably already know this. For those of you guys who do not know how to use H how to use an HTML or create it, I'm gonna be posting this in the description. You have to post it just like this, everything exact. You want to put your website right here with the colon eight one two three or whatever port you have. Um, after you do that. You can just hit update or whatever you do, save it. And then the final outcome will be just like. Oops. The final outcome will be this. Oh, one's acting up on me. Hold on. Why does it keep popping up? There we go. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I have not in, uh, full render mine yet. I'm doing that tonight because I just opened the server. But everything will be scoped or, full, or will be rendered. Now, see, I have mine on high run. It goes from every single block. So you can see anything you want to see. Um, now, but I do have Dynap in Essentials. Very useful. It tells you where everyone's homes are and whatnot. They have tons of add ons for Dy Dynap. But that's pretty much it. You can mess around with it. Remember, like I said, it's different for each server. I mean, each website. Um, hope this guy. I hope this helped. And also, I will be posting the HTML in the description, along with my server IP, if anyone wants to join it. And also, one last thing up in that top here, it tells you what time of day it is, which is very useful, I guess. All right. I hope you guys like this video. Please comment, subscribe. Thanks.